also, it's like... I completely uh, missed these coordinates. I have both coordinates uh, that I've found around in the environment, which I have written down, which are sort of extra things to find. Um, and these are objectives. And once we find them, like this one we found, it gets crossed over like that. So after we've found all of the objectives, that's when you finish the game, as far as I understand it. Uh, so maybe we should start cross crossing off these things, yay. But um, I don't even know where I am at the moment, so uh, I can't do that right now. So let's let's just try and figure out where the heck the um, I can't see the the red tower uh, thingy blinking, which I used to navigate by. So just give me a sec. I think. Oh, there's um, fire there. Also, apparently, well, the light... This starts to go wonky when there's a, a creature or a spirit nearby. Um, I was told... What the hell? I'm completely cut off. Uh, so you could have that on, like, all the time, I suppose. And then, um, it's really annoying that you can't jump up there and you can't crouch down here. So it could take me to do these, these things. Oh, look there. Well, have I typed that down already? No, I haven't, have I? Nope. 11 north, 55... East. That's very close to 10 north, 57 east, which should also be. So I. Just, this is very tricky. Right, so we had our little note there. Well, which note could that be? I suppose... This feels like it's the wrong direction, but I'm gonna try and drop down here. Oh my god! Well, damn it! I wish I'd never found this, this freaking note, because I'm... I was doing just fine before this. Now I feel completely cut off from everything. I mean, I'm supposed to get here because there is a note. 
you know, so you're supposed to be able to get here and get out of here, but fuck if I know. This is the only way I can think of. And I mean, it's not like I can, since that was the checkpoint, I don't know. Uh, I mean, I, by this point I would have loaded another checkpoint, you know. Uh, screw Well, let's try this again, shall we? I think that I can crouch. I forgot that you could crouch in this game. So then maybe we can get through here. Yay! Silly me. You had such limited... Um... It's such limited uh, movement in this game that I thought Ooh. that I thought you couldn't. I've forgotten. This is the problem with playing several games at the same time uh, and not, you know, being so well, um, being so good at. Um, Remembering the different, uh, oh, there it is, all the way over there. Well, not being so very good at remembering which was what, where. So, my apologies. I take full responsibility for being this. This much of a doofus. Whoa. This is a big place. But this is another question where I wonder, can I come back here? If I drop down here? There sort of sure seems to be a lot of human sacrifice going on in this game. Possibly. That is so cool. I like that one. Now, I think I hear a note, but it could also be the... Yeah, I do hear a note. I thought it might be the sound of the um, fire. Really hard to make out though. It look. It look it, it don't want to walk away from it, but I also don't know if it's above me. That's one of the major issues with this. But I can't really. I can't walk in here. Right. Oh, Jesus. There it was. We discovered the first bodies by the pine trees. A makeshift campfire suggested they tried to warm up. The bodies were only in underwear. I decided to thoroughly search the area between the tent and the tree line. I discovered the other bodies every few hundred meters apart. Their position indicated the victims attempted to return to the tent as fast as they could. This could mean that the threat was gone and the group decided to go back to the tent, or just the opposite. Someone or something appeared from the forest and forced its victims to run. At this point, it is difficult to determine what exactly happened. I have collected small samples from all bodies for further research at the unit's laboratory. 
I discussed the situation with the rest of the rescue team and afterwards they focused on the visual inspection of the tent and areas by the trees and I entered the forest. How the hell did I do that? I fucking did everything. I ran from where the the, the smoke wasn't. Oh, this game. It's driving me nuts. <laughs> Okay, I thought since there was smoke to my left side that I should go down there, but obviously not. That wasn't my fault, that was the game doing something. that I just completely fell through the world This game, it makes absolutely no sense. It drives me nuts. What the hell do you want me to do? Run from the danger? But not? The things it teaches you, it goes back on. 
and I'm so bored of playing the same section again and again and again. Just because you... <sighs> nope, that's break time. Bullshit.